Hello and welcome to another YouTube video on Dress My Craft channel. This is Ujwal and today we are uh, doing a very interesting home decor project using um, things that were actually lying around. So it's a trash, trash to treasure project for me. I've been saving these packaging boxes, uh, the wooden boxes for a long, long time and I finally decided to do something about it. So what we are going to do is we are going to convert this into a cute masculine shadow frame. So let's get started. First step would be to glue them all together and uh, convert them into a rectangle shape. So I'm going for a symmetrical um, shape here but if you have boxes of different size you could uh, arrange them creatively into a different shape as well and that would look really nice too. So uh, I'm using Fab Fevy Bond here. This is easily available at any hardware shop. This glue so uh, it requires um, you to apply the glue and then leave it for about 15 minutes before you actually stick the two surfaces together. So I'm going to leave it here and then after 15 minutes you just have to press all the pieces together and there you go. You have this one uh, complete shadow box ready to be embellished. So I'm going to use some clips here just to um, hold it all together and keep it tight and nice uh, until it dries completely. And since these boxes aren't very strong, I'm going to uh, definitely reinforce the back as well. I will either add a piece of cardboard or maybe an FDF um, sheet if I can get one. So for the paper bag, I'm using the beautiful My Gentleman paper bag. This is um, one of the best masculine themed paper bag I've seen. And we are going to um, cut out little squares using our trimmer uh, that can fit into each of these little boxes. So the box is measured a little more than one and a half inch um, uh, and I'm going to just, I'm using two sheets of paper here and um, I will just mix and match these two sheets and create a more interest uh, in the boxes instead of using just one paper or instead of using a whole lot of different papers that would have um, uh, made it difficult to embellish. So as you can see I have this beautiful beige brown black thing going. Um, I cut out all these squares and I'm just going to um, use a glue here and adhere these uh, pieces down. So once I had this complete thing covered with pattern paper, I decided to look for all the things that I can use to embellish and of course I'm using um, metal charms here. Then I had saved some of the items uh, from our house renovation time and I have like door latches and old screws and rusted uh, door handles and all that. And uh, of course I will be using the coordinating motif sheet from the My Gentleman collection. And uh, yeah, this part is always a fun, but I take a lot of time doing this. So as you can see, I'm just uh, trying to figure out, taking out a bunch of things and um, deciding what to do with it. So yeah, and uh, that's it. I, that's all I did. All it now needs are some black and white vintage photographs and it is going to look so, so good on a wall. Um, and uh, yeah. I just went on and hot glued everything and this is the final result. As you can see, I've added a little tiny vial with some glitter and beads. Um, and then I have this metal button, some motive sheets, uh, elements here. Then I added glossy accents to the clock, this little piece of clock. And I also used jute and jute twine and some uh, copper thread as well to complement the entire vintage theme here. And I absolutely love how this turned out. Here are some close-up pictures so you can see the embellishments. And yeah, I can't wait to add some photos to it and hang it on my wall. So I hope you enjoyed this process. If you did, don't forget to like the video, share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel. And I will see you again next time. Bye-bye.